Alright. Here we go. Hi everyone and welcome to TWF Monday Night Raw or Moonday Night Raw. I am shit. That was a mistake. Welcome to Monday Night Raw, Moonday Night Raw. I am Gorilla Monsoon, here with Aladdin and with Samoa Joe. And today, we're going to have the TWF Heavyweight Winnings going to be on the line, because Drew McIntyre, it's just learned now, he's going to be putting his TWF Heavyweight Winnings on the line against a someone that he would say was his friend, Godzilla. Would you say that? Well, the way I look at Aladdin said is that Godzilla did fill in for him at one time. But if that earned Godzilla a seat to become the TWF heavyweight winner again, I don't know. Well, Godzilla's won that many times in the past, Samoa Joe said. So I don't really know if that would be any unlike here. But anyway, Samoa Joe says it's going to be one half of a fight. But I don't know why Godzilla would be facing Drew McIntyre for it. All right, Drew McIntyre says, I understand I have to, f oh, I can't stand up, fuck. I understand that I got to put my TWF heavyweight winnings on the line. And the way that I, I can't bloody stand up is so bad. Yeah, do I really need to have a, a bloody stand just to hold, just to stand up? Probably not. So... I understand the day that I got to be facing someone who filled in for me way back when I had Crovid, and that would be Godzilla. It just came out of nowhere, you know. I lost, you know, this comes out of nowhere, and I wonder if this is a hint. I wonder, but if I had to face Godzilla, that's good, because I know I'll beat him like I beat everyone else. Well, Drew, that is great to know that you're ready to go and you're such a good sport about facing my brother Godzilla. Yeah, some folks wouldn't be good sports about having to put their, head, their TWF heavyweight winnings on the line, Andrew says. Yeah, that's true, Astronomer says. You're facing Godzilla today and a lot of folks wouldn't be so happy about that. Yeah, Eclipter says, it's good to know that you're such a great sport about all the whole, all that. Well, that's the kind of man I am, Drew McIntyre says. So if Godzilla wants to fight me, that's fine with me, Astronomer. That's fine with me, Caron. Just know you're going to be picking up his teeth out of the ring after I Claymore kick him and get the one, two, three. Oh, all, all fun aside, Godzilla said, you're not going to be kicking my teeth out of my mouth. All right, Astronomer says, today on Monday Night Raw, we're going to see my brother Godzilla fight Drew McIntyre for the TWF heavyweight winnings. This fight starts now. Well, Astronomer out of the ring now. Well, Astronomer who's got out of the ring, or also known as Corone to some folks, uh, out of the ring. Andros is also out of the ring now. So is Eclipter, he's out of the ring, Michael Cole, I mean, uh, Gro Monsoon says. Yeah, well, I always want to know, Aladdin says, why does Astronomer always get to have all her, her kin and her friends with her? Well, this is for... The TWF heavyweight winnings. First, he is Godzilla, and he is from Al Errol, Scotland. He is the TWF heavyweight winner, Drew McIntyre. Well, we're going to see how this fight plays out or not. Gorilla Monsoon says here on Monday Night Raw, the TWF heavyweight winnings, it goes back to 9 between 93 while with Earthquake. Yeah, it goes back that long, Aladdin says. And Drew McIntyre is uh, is happy to be on a list of so many heavyweight winners 
for about nine between years. Nine between years, Samoa Joe says. Is that really how old the Tito heavyweight winnings is? The oldest heavyweight winnings in all of toy wrestling. Uh, Girl Monsoon says, right out the front. Drew McIntyre thought he was going to claim our kick Godzilla, but Godzilla got out of the way. And now Godzilla gave him the stunner, but it looked more like it was a, a, a fucked up offshoot of the stunner. Here we go. Oh, a stunner again. This time, that's a good one, Girl Monsoon says. Is Godzilla going to win this here? Aladdin said, we're going to have a new TWF heavyweight winner. I don't know, Samoa Joe says. But I don't like Drew McIntyre seeking or Godzilla seeking. One, two, and... Drew McIntyre just kicked out. And old Claymore kicked down Godzilla again. Who he did face him before. And he thinks he's going to do it. But now Godzilla's got him off. Godzilla just hit him down with his tail. Girl Monsoon says, Look out, the Godzilla stunner Aladdin says, I'll put anyone out. Yeah, Samoa Joe said Godzilla took that from Steve Austin. And Kevin Owens took that from Steve Austin too. And it's done. Samoa Joe said, Drew McIntyre's lording as a TW heavyweight winner is done. One, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here is your winner. And the new TWF heavyweight winner, Godzilla. And once again, Godzilla is the TWF heavyweight winner. He's won that winnings many times since 9 between 98 YL, Girl Monsoon said. Yeah, he has, Aladdin said. He has won that belt many times. Well, Samoa Joe says, I don't know if Drew McIntyre is going to be so happy to losing to Godzilla, but looks like he is because he just shook his hand, and they, Godzilla and Drew McIntyre shook hands, and now Drew's out of the ring now. And Godzilla now is once again the TWF heavyweight winner. And a lot of folks might say, how did this happen? Why is Godzilla the new TWF heavyweight winner? Uh, Gorilla, uh, Gorilla Monsoon says, Well, the truth is, Aladdin says, This match, this fight came out of nowhere. And to be earnest with you, I don't think Godzilla or Drew McIntyre knew they would be wrestling and fighting each other here today on Monday Night Raw or Monday Night Raw. Well, I'll tell you one thing, Samoa Joe says, Godzilla, I don't like him. But... He does have on look, so I'll give him that. But if Godzilla was truly bad, then he would have done a lot more evil or things to Drew McIntyre. Well, let's listen up to Godzilla now, because he's got something to say. I'll tell you right now, Godzilla says, I'm now once again the TWF heavyweight winner. And I'm coming after you, King Kong. Yeah, you know... Me and you had two fights in the TWF, and now I'm the TWF heavyweight winner. So if you want to make yesteryear King Kong with me again, see, I'm going to get back at that loss you gave to me back in 19, 9 between 63 YL. You know, I'm going to get back at that loss. I shouldn't have lost to you that day. But I'm going to make up for it in 2021 while by beating you up in my new film, Godzilla Fights King Kong. And then I'm going to make up for it by beating you up here in the TWF. So, if you're bold enough, King Kong, yeah, you were bold enough to beat me up from behind, to beat Steve Austin up from behind. But I don't think you're bold enough to face me layer to layer, because that's not who you are. You're the weakling that the only thing you know how to do when things get hard is to climb up a climb up a house. Yeah. And pretty much all of your films, that's how you died. Yeah. You haven't really had any up any up following King Kong film except for Son of Kong. But is that really actually gonna be your follow up? Yeah. You got no follow ups. Well, Godzilla right now, coming off as a creep in a heel, Gorilla Monsoon says, saying shit about King Kong here on Monday Night Raw. And we also keep in mind that Godzilla and King Kong have this on and off 
kinship between each other, more of a love and hate kinship going on. They most likely hate the, each other more than they love each. They like each other. Girl Monsoon says, Well, Aladdin says, Godzilla's always been that in-between. There were times in Godzilla's film calling where he was the heel. Then there were times where he was the good doer. And then it was back to when he was the heel or the creep. And I guess Godzilla being a good doer, it, that time's over. And now he's being an evil doer again, Aladdin says. I like the creep. I like the heel Godzilla. That's the true Godzilla. You know, that's the Godzilla everybody loves. It's like when Steve Austin was healed from 9 between 96 YL to 9 between 97 YL. And it was like when he was healed again in 2001 YL. You know, a lot of folks bitch about his 2001 while he'll run, but whatever. I understand, uh, but I liked it. Oh, would you be earnest? Would you stop Samoa Joe saying you liked Godzilla when he was heel? Saying you liked Steve Austin when he was heel? Well, I know one thing Aladdin says. Samoa Joe, you have the right to your thought and belief, but I don't think, any, I don't think a lot of folks like creeps and heels like you do. Michael Cole's going to be talking with King Kong. That's right, Gorilla Monsoon. I'm going to be talking with King Kong here. I'm going to be... That's right, I'm going to be talking with King Kong here now. All right, King Kong. I You should have heard the things that Godzilla said about you after he became the TWF heavyweight winner. Yeah, I heard all the shit that he said about me. Shit that Godzilla's been saying about me since 9 between 63 while when I beat him in the Hojo Universal Overlap film. Called King Kong Fight Godzilla. Yeah. See, and Godzilla doesn't like me because I don't give him the on look as the king. You're no king, Godzilla. Let's be earnest about that. You call yourself King of the Fiends. But that was just a title that uh, someone at Universal came up with, with Hojo, when they wanted to get your first film outside of the Dawnland. But you were never king of the fiends, Godzilla. And see, you got the, you got the, you got the English word God in the beginning of your name. And I got the English word King in the beginning of my name. So now you see why we don't get along. Well, that is true, King Kong, that King is, is in your name and God is in Godzilla. And uh, that is that the grounds to why you two don't get along? Because one has God in its name and everyone's got King in its name? I don't bow down to Godzilla or give him the on look. Is that he doesn't need it. He's not a true king, to be earnest with you. This rank, King of the Fiends. It's nothing more, it's like calling yourself Stunning Steve Austin or Stone Cold Steve Austin or the Ring ring Teacher Steve Austin. It's like calling yourself the real toughest SOB. It's like, whatever. Making yourself look like, look like a bad booty when you're not. Godzilla, I beat you before in my first film. You may have beat me two times in the TWF, but I will beat you again in a two forward film. And I'll beat you here in the TWF. And I'll be the TWF heavyweight winner, Godzilla. So much how you run your mouth off when I'm not around, right? And when I'm around, then you have nothing to say. You talk about how I made all these films going back to 9, nine between 35 YL. And how I never had a follow-up film. And how I kept dying. And all my films were remakes. Yeah, they were remakes. I can no run or lead over that, Godzilla. But with experience about you, Godzilla, you're handicapped because you kept on making you fight big fiends all the time. And with experience about it, Godzilla, if it wasn't for me, you wouldn't even have your fucking films. Because Hojo looked at what we were doing, Hojo looked at my film and said, geez, we got to do something to out counter King Kong, right? And while, before I end this film here, Godzilla somehow seems to get into his head since he's made more films than anyone else in the world that somehow that makes him greater. Yeah, he may have made more films than me. I made too many remakes. He made more films than anyone else out there. But you don't see him saying shit about Gamera, right? But you know what? I'm going to beat the shit out of you, Godzilla. 
Well, King Kong, I know you and Godzilla have been foes for a long time, and I sure hope that one day you two can end this hang-up between each other, Michael Cole says. I wish I could, Michael Cole. I wish I could. Well, good luck to you, King Kong, in your fight with Godzilla. You're welcome. Well, that was, our that was my talk with King Kong, who is going to be fighting Godzilla sometime down the road, I guess, for the TWF heavyweight winnings. Back to you, Gorilla Monsoon. Well, thank you, Michael Cole, for talking with King Kong here on Monday Night Raw, or Moonday Night Raw. It has been what a show... We had Drew McIntyre fight Godzilla. Godzilla beat Drew McIntyre for the TWF heavyweight winnings, Girl Monsoon says. Yeah, you're right about that, Girl Monsoon. And just to let everybody know, the NWO is still not going to show up. It's for another, you know, good to know the NWO is not going to show up at all. I wouldn't say that, Simone Joe says. The NWO have big ears. And their ears will get red when they start hearing folks talk about them. And we keep saying something, they'll sadly want to show up. But anyway, Samoa Joe said, I like Godzilla being a hill and being a creep. And I know Godzilla's going to beat King Kong in his new film. He's going to beat King Kong in a TWF. Well, you got the rule, Samoa Joe said. You got, oh, you're not, would you, would you be earnest? Do you really think that Godzilla, King Kong, you really think that Godzilla is going to beat King Kong in the TWF in his new film, Samoa Joe? Give me a break, Grill Monsoon says. Liking Hill Godzilla. You're right about that, Aladdin said. No one really liked Godzilla as a heel or a creep. Or a bully. Or any of those other words, you, English words you could say. But it looks like it is all the time we do have here for TWF Monday Night Raw or Monday Night Raw. I am Gorilla Monsoon for Aladdin and Samoa Joe. We hope you like Monday Night Raw or Moonday Night Raw. And we'll see you tomorrow for Impact.